back again. Yep, yep, I'm back again. Yeah, um, I'm emo now. So in this vlog, I do a mukbang with Trent, and I explain how I became emo. And we talk about shit that I never talked about on my channel. Um, so I watch this full mukbang. Uh, this is my first time Trent getting to share my shake and shit in this vlog. And I just enjoy it. I like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And yeah, I'm emo, nigga. I'm emo. All right, y'all. Um, I had to switch on my phone. I would connect the mic, but now I got the adapter. So, so we're gonna try this shamrock shake and talk about life and shit. Shit, give me no napkins, bro. You're cool. I got wipes. You're cool. All right. Who needs his wipes? Alright, we're gonna get this video started. So you ain't you ain't never had this shit before. Nah, bro, I ain't never had this bitch, so I don't even care. Shit, okay. So I know you already know. I, I barely I already know how this shit does. Be a fake ass reaction. Type shit. So should I go? Yeah, you can be like, you know what I'm saying? Is it ass? Like, how you feel about it? Is that no, Omo, it's hard to suck. <laughs> the fuck? The fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna tell my girl, bro. I got too much power going, bro. It's straight. You like with it? Yeah, it's cool. It's like 1 through 10. It's not good. It's like a, a seven. Same shit. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. You don't, you don't fuck with it, bro? I mean, nah, I fuck <laughs> with it. But like, would I get another one? Probably not. You know what I'm saying? But like, it's cool. You feel me? I fuck with it. You know what I'm saying? But not to the point, like, how I be getting slushies. Like, yeah, I, I be getting I'll them. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, you probably get this how I get slushies. You know what I'm saying? This shit come like once a month. Mm. Yeah, it's rare when you get these. So what made you start YouTube? I was bored. You was bored? I was bored. You know what I'm saying? And then, and when I, I had started YouTube low key when it was a trend. Like, it was a trend? It was low key a trend, I ain't gonna cap. Like, um, niggas was, I was just seeing like, niggas starting YouTube and shit. And I was like, why not? You know what I'm saying? Like, like doing the You talking about people in school and shit? Just like people on my Instagram. Like my oh yeah, that's what I'm talking. I see, I see that shit too. Yeah, hey, yeah. But like they don't be consistent with it. You know what I'm saying? Like they'll probably just really post a page. Like they won't even post a video. You feel me? <laughs> I ain't but niggas I like that, family, bro. I, was like, I, I ain't niggas like that, bro. But I, uh, I was like, I'm gonna just be consistent with it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got like your top five favorite videos? Like, can you name your top five? I don't think I got a top five videos. Um, that you did, that you made yourself and shit. The Lena Streetwear Market, mm -hmm. first one. The Lena Streetwear Market, the second one. You got two of them? Yeah, I've been there twice, nigga. Damn. The one that I was doing the interviews and the one that I was actually been there. Uh -huh, I remember that yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Um, actually, let me look. Well, he wait. I'll tell you my top five. Lil Joe, the sit down is on there. <laughs> that shit is on top five of the show. Um, I want to say the public interview with the when was the last time you got laid when I had a sc blue scary money hoodie on. Um, that's probably the second one. Third, I think my last three would probably be my mutt bangs because those shits always I fuck with those heavy. Yours is on there for sure. I fuck with the one I did with Tay and the one I did with Quan. That probably the top five for me, bro. I personally did. Cause bro, everybody answers just had like a different perspective and shit. That's why I fuck with it. Okay. You feel me? Top five for sure. It was those two. Blinded. 
Bro, I had so many videos. I got it Monday. Uh, it was one. It was one. Uh, the who knows me better with my friends and shit. Mm. And then the fifth one is what could you the the interview? What could you buy with your body count? I remember that one, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Really calm down with the public interviews and shit. You feel me? Even yeah. like that was like kind of getting views. You know what I'm saying? But it's just like, I don't know. Like, how many views the audience? I was really just trying and shit. I'm not gonna cap. You just testing it, shit yeah, out. See what trying. people fuck with yeah. and what people don't fuck with. Mm -hmm. Cause I was new to the shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, um, why you start YouTube? Why the fuck did I start YouTube? Oh, um, the same shit. At first, it was a trend. You know what I'm saying? Like, Actually, yeah, it was a trend. You feel mm -hmm. me? And I like be doing it. Mm -hmm. I like used to like watching it. You know what I'm saying? DDG and shit. And I was like, let me try it myself. Yeah. Cause damn, bro, I used to have vlogs when I was in middle school, right? Mm -hmm. I did vlogs in middle school. But then I was cussing in my videos, right? Mm -hmm. Then people in my family was seeing that shit, and I took this shit down. Yeah. Then I did like. Then after that, I stopped. Not because of that, it was because how my channel was, it was corny and shit. You feel me? I already told you that. Yeah. But, um. Uh, yeah, that was really it. Seeing that as a trend. I want to try it out. Then I realized I love doing it. I feel you. You feel me? Yeah, I do this shit damn near every day. You see what the fuck I was doing in that church, looking at the inner leaks all day. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Just no, okay. Leave it alone. <laughs> but hopefully, we reach 800. Don't know when, shit. No capping. This gonna take a little minute to finish. I ain't gonna lie. That really is, bro. When this shit hit like probably 10, I end this bitch off. So, what made you do COVID? Um. I like clothes. You know what I'm saying? And I just wanted to start a brand. But this is my second brand. Did you know that? Did I tell you yeah, that? Yeah, you told me that. I remember you showed me you? you showed me your first one and shit. You know, it was me and Quan and you and the was ass, wasn't it? Yeah, you said you. <laughs> I mean, like. I mean, you I, sometimes gotta test some shit. Cause I, I, like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I had some shit before. But I never dropped it because I didn't fuck with it. I was mm -hmm. like, this shit don't feel right. I need some shit that's gonna be like niggas gonna wanna buy it. That's why I'm really working on working on mines right now. Uh, yeah. Smelling this shit behind the scenes. And that's gonna be our merch, you feel me? When I get this shit to work. But I know how that be. Yeah, we'll go ahead yeah, and finish. Um what's Oh yeah. Um I had a brand before the brand I have. It was like when I was in 10th grade, 11th grade, my fault. 11th grade. And I really just gave up on the shit. I'm not gonna cap. Like, it wasn't doing how I was expecting it to do. Um, niggas is buying the shit, you feel me? But, but like, you still sale, bro. yeah, I was getting sales and shit, but like, I wasn't making no profit. Like, I ain't have no knowledge back then, you know what I'm saying? You ain't know the shit that you know now. Man. Yeah, like, I wasn't really making profit at all. I'm not gonna lie, you feel me? So, Perfect. now I got way more knowledge and shit. Now I can, I feel like I can definitely do that, do this long term, you feel me? Yeah, damn, this nigga was giving me shit that I didn't even know about, bro. <laughs> he just let me on, bro, behind the uh, scenes yeah, and bro. shit. You feel me? Got to. I think just pulled over. Fuck you. No, it's my man. Okay, shit. So, like, what kind of relationship advice can you give me and shit? Um, you're not in a relationship, though. I mean, like, I want a girlfriend and shit. You want a girlfriend? I do. I've been feeling wishy washy, bro. That's what Quan said, bro. He said he, <laughs> said he wanted a girlfriend. Too, <laughs> I seen that in the group chat. I was gonna respond. Yeah. I was like, wait. Mm. I said, don't rush it. You know what I'm saying? Let it come to you. 
You feel me? Yeah. So how did you and your girl meet? Um. <sighs> my best friend. Nah, never mind. I lied. I was gonna say she put me on, but she lucky didn't. Um. Mm -hmm. It was in ninth grade. And. Ninth grade? Yeah. Oh, y'all been here? It's in ninth grade. But what the fuck? On and off, though. You know what I'm saying? Oh, go ahead. Bring it up. On and off and shit. You feel right, me? Go ahead. But. Uh, you know how you just first see somebody? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's literally how it was. I mean, I ain't gonna cut. Like, <laughs> when I first seen her, like, I liked her type shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm just like, damn, like, you know what I'm saying? She looked good and shit, you know what I'm saying? And, um, like, she was fucking with somebody already, you know mm. what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I really just had to, like, literally just wait, play the waiting game. Wait, so you played the long game? I played yeah, the waiting man. game. But I was fucking with other people, though, you feel me? Oh, no, that be. Yeah, you feel me? Sure. I was fucking with other people and shit, you know what I'm saying? But, like, I really wanted her, mm. you know what I'm saying? And then... As soon as she, you know what I'm saying, got single and shit, feel me? I hopped in. Did you do it then? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, all that. All that. And she told me, like, she been like me too, you know what I'm saying? But, she, like, she couldn't just, like, she didn't want to just leave the person she was messing with, you know what I'm saying, for me, because she didn't really know me, you know what I'm saying? I feel what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. Post oh, for shit. But just, just, um, like I said, just, Wait, you know what I'm saying? And like, if you like somebody, make sure it's neutral. I mean, I said neutral, mutual. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, like she like you too on some shit. Like she giving you the same energy. You feel me? Because if she not, well, GG's, man. <laughs> Leave her alone. No cap. Yeah. No cap. Yeah, bro. I know I went through that shit, bro. Hmm. Like the girl, that's the problem with, bro. Yeah. Man, I just might look. Should I leak this shit on the Fuck video? It, bro. Fuck it. Y'all niggas, the niggas was like OG subscribe probably know this shit, bro. It's probably about like you still follow her and shit. I still follow her. Ain't like we you ain't seeing her and shit. Like on Instagram, we ain't. It'd be like we talk, we talk, but it'd be like quick talk. Oh, so y'all still be talking? Not like how we talk, talk, but how we used to talk. But like, it'd be like find the stories and shit. I say it was my birthday on some shit. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. And that shit, that's it. <laughs> so that's not talking, nigga. That's just a happy birthday. Yeah, on some shit. Like, like back on, nigga. Cause my video ain't finna be dark as hell. Fuck out of here, nigga. Alright. But, what the fuck I was saying? Oh, yeah, I was talking, niggas. So, y'all know the girl, bro. Like, she was in the Valentine's Day video. I did two vlogs with her. Y'all probably, some niggas probably don't even know that, but my OG subscribers do that shit. And y'all seen this short. I never dropped the vlog because I didn't like how it came out. I did a pump post. You feel me? But the thing that happened with her was, it was how you like- you felt about your pump post? I feel like this shit was hard. You, you think my shit was hard? This shit was great. I ain't gonna cap. This shit was great. My shit was tough. This shit you was feel great. me? But it was like, she was playing was games. Great. You feel me? Damn. It was like, at their prom proposal, right? I'm gonna give y'all the little story, bro, because we was shit chatting. Did you have help? Oh yeah, I had help. Like, the I'm shit was like, last minute though. I wasn't thinking. I seen the help. I'm saying like, like thinking about it type of shit. Like, did anybody like help you? Like, think about it. Like, tell you what to do. Tell me what to do. Oh yeah, they they did like the day of. Yeah. So <laughs> you didn't even know that you was gonna do it. I know. I, I knew I was gonna do it. I knew I was gonna do it. Actually, I did text a couple people. I'm, I'm slow. I'm like, I'm gonna tell. Type shit. I, I told a couple people to help me out about it. Feel me? Some niggas came to the lunch period, mm -hmm. help me up, Ooh, bang, bang. Mm -hmm. And then I told my counselor, mm -hmm. you feel me? Then I made the shit happen. Yeah. So I was like, okay, I knew I want, I was fucking with her. I said, I knew I wanted her to go to prom and shit. Mm -hmm. So then, you know, after the prom shit, it was like, she was just playing games all the time, mm -hmm. like in my face, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, um, to one time, huh? to it wasn't even before. It wasn't even, prom but before prom proposal oh, okay. too, bro. She was just always just playing in my face. I'm like, fuck. Like I'm gonna break it down, bro. Cause I ain't never told these niggas this mm -hmm. shit. And I was like, I wanted to make this video one time, but some people was like, no, nah, no, nah, do it. But I'm talking about fuck this it, fucking this video. So it was like after Valentine's Day, I asked her like, let's do, let's go out somewhere on some shit. You mm -hmm. feel me? So I was like. 
let's go. We were supposed to go somewhere. I think it was like, where the fuck we supposed to go? I think it was like Red Lobster or some shit like that, right? Amy, I have a car to him. I did. <laughs> <laughs> we all, I'm breaking out this story, though. Uh, so, uh, she was like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? She down to go. Woo -woo. Bang, bang. So then, I'm texting her the day of day before i'm like you still trying to go with Wu bang she said yeah for sure but you know i gotta go to work all right right mm -hmm. i'm like okay for sure she said after work we can go with Wu bang bang so then i text her right mm -hmm. bam text her i'm like um we going still Wu bang bang she's like yeah i'm still gonna go um you know what i'm saying um just go there i'm gonna be there or Wu -woo bang bang so I go to the spot. She stood you up. She stood me up, nigga. That's funny. That's the worst feeling ever. I got stood up one time. She stood me the fuck up, bro. I was like, nigga, I look after the, the place. I mean, I, I took an Uber there. Mm -hmm. and I wasted bought some fucking money. Wasted money. Then I uh brought some Little Caesars, right? The shit was cold, bro. I bought some Little Caesars. I put some Little Caesars. It was Little Caesars like up the street. So I was like, fuck it, I'm going to Little Caesars. I ain't gonna even go inside Red Lobster and eat nothing, bro. Mm -hmm. I went inside Little Caesars. Mm -hmm. Brought this pizza and mm -hmm. it was cold as fuck. So then the next day we go to school. You know what I'm saying? I'm a bit mad as fuck. I I, I caught fries, but I said the shit you did was lame as hell. Yeah. So she like like laughing in my face. No. Yes, bro. She's just laughing, bro. Like like this shit didn't happen. You know what I'm saying? Like that shit actually hurt me. Damn. Shit. I ain't tell nobody like this shit. Like she laughed like dead ass. She just like laughing like this shit That's never crazy. like nothing happened. That's you crazy, feel me? Son. Like nothing, like this shit never happened. Like everything I did, like you feel me. So then I'm like, I'm not talking to her red ass no more. You feel me? She's weird as fuck. But as you know, I still liked her, so I was still trying to talk to her mm -hmm. in my brain. You feel me? But after the prom shit, I cut her off completely. Mm -hmm. But then it's, it's just weird shit. People, I'm gonna yeah, give you more. I'm gonna get more into the story on funny. how we kind of mutual, but we don't. I don't fuck with her still a little bit. So then. Later on in the day, we in fourth period. You know what I'm saying? Me and her had the same fourth period and we had the same lunch period. So we was sitting by each other. You feel me? I ain't saying shit to her. She ain't saying shit to me. And I just forgave her. I don't know why the fuck I did that, but I was fucking with her too much. I just forgave yeah. her. So then I was like, you know, it's cool. You feel me? We all made mistakes, shit like that. So then um, two months later, you know what I'm saying? The prom proposal happened. And I asked her to prom, you know? But I wasn't, I was telling her about it, but I didn't tell her, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, I was telling her about it. Fuck, bro. <laughs> fuck, bro. We gonna get one to you. So I was telling her about it, but I didn't tell her. So then we go to prom, you know, I do the prom proposal. I'm telling people to help me out. They do the proposal, you feel me? So then, the day or two after the proposal, she gonna talk about some. Well, um, I really just said that because a lot of people there and shit like that. No. Um, goddamn. She posted shit in her spam no. talking about she said yes. No. And then she gonna talk about Fucking some. Way. She gonna talk about some. What the fuck her weird ass gonna talk about some? She gonna talk about some. Remember, bro. bro, who the fuck does she think she is? <laughs> she like, yeah, I just did it just because the people was there and shit like that. And I'm like, that hurt. That really hurt me then. I was like, damn, bro. bro. You stood me up then. You do that shit too. It's like, damn. You shouldn't have even asked her ass. I ain't gonna lie. That's like, damn, bro. So then. That shit been a red flag. After that, I, I just stopped talking to her. You feel me? And, um, you know, Mr. Hobbs, right? Mm -hmm. So, counseling nigga, Mr. Hobbs. He like, What's going on with y'all too? I see y'all talk all the time. I'm telling the nigga, I'm like, bro, it's like very complicated. You feel me? Like, mm -hmm. she's weird. You feel me? Like, the shit I was doing, it was like genuine, but she was just always on some weird shit. So then he always thought, cause she used to tell, she used to tell him stuff about me, but he would never tell me what the fuck she said. He's like, I can't disclose that. You know, that's what that's against my job. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm like, all right, bro. You feel me? Ooh, ooh, bam, bam. So then. We go to the cafeteria one day. Uh, Mr. Hobbs is like, I'm going to get y'all two to talk and still go to prom. Ooh, bang, bang. Me end up still not going, regardless, right? Oh, and I found out she started fucking with somebody else in the school anyways, right? Really? Yeah. You know him? Yeah, I know the nigga? Yeah. I seen him before. Shit like, like that. know him. Like, he ain't know him. 
Like as a friend type shit? Or like, like know him type shit. Is I did. Like cool. We wasn't like mutual, no. We wasn't talking like that, no. Type shit. And then I'm gonna get more into the story with him too and her. She she was asking me questions about the nigga, which was weird as fuck. I'm getting I'm getting into that in a second. So then uh -huh. Mr. Hobbs was like, she in the cafeteria, right? He's like, I'm gonna get y'all two to talk again and try to get y'all to go to prom and shit. So I'm like, fuck it. I don't really don't give a fuck. Whatever it is, we talk. So then. You're better off going by yourself. I'm better off going by myself anyway. You feel me? So then. We sit at the table. Uh, she's sitting like a chair behind me. I sit right in front of her. Mr. Hobbs is right next to her. So then she starts laughing. She's like, why is he right here, right? <laughs> like, cause me and her hasn't talked in life for like two weeks since she said that weird ass shit. You feel mm -hmm. me? Then um Mr. Hobbs like, um, so like what's going on with you two? You feel me? He asking, like, how come y'all we used to talk all the time? Like, what's going on and shit like that. I just break it down to them. I'm like, bro, she just like she did this, you know what I'm saying? And then, um, on top of that, I didn't add this to the story, bro. It was this girl in my class, bro. She was just, she was messy as fuck. Like, mm -hmm. every time she would tell me shit, that wouldn't even be fully true. But I just knew she was, it's hard to explain with that shit. Anyways, we go back to Mr. Hobbs talking to us. So he's like, what's going on with us two and shit? I'm like, you know, she said this about the prom shit. And I was like, I can't fuck with her. No more, mm -hmm. That shit was weird, you feel me? And she's like. Well, he assumed uh, this happened, but it really didn't. Cause this girl, she showed me like a thing on Instagram mm -hmm. that kind of made me like, oh yeah, I can't follow her no more, bro. But the shit was, it wasn't like added. It wasn't even. I was wrong. I was assuming the wrong shit. Mm -hmm. So then Mr. Hobbs was like, y'all should still go with Wu Bang Bang. I was like, I really don't got no problem with her, but she just be doing the weirdest shit. You feel me? Like, I ain't really do anything. She always she still me up and did all that shit. She's like, well, he's like, well, I did text you. She's talking about some. Shit. I blocked her right after she did that weird shit. I promise you, right? <laughs> she was like, well, I text you. I was just trying to let you know it was a joke. So I knew you. And I was like, why you ain't talking to me? You just say it in my face. Then you feel me? So then after that, we just mutual, bro. We wasn't no like, you know, like fuck with you and shit like that. That was it. He ain't go to prom. Yeah, she texted me when I graduated. She said, I'm so proud of shit like that. She said happy birthday, so I told her happy birthday. That was it. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, bro. That's actually crazy. <laughs> That's what happened. That's crazy, bro. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> he, said, he said, That's crazy. That's crazy as fuck. Yeah, but that's really the reason why I been. Was she her early graduate? Did she graduate? She didn't graduate with us, but she graduated probably December and shit. Oh. Yeah. Man, you don't know, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. Hey, go ahead and say your thoughts. That's it. Bro, it's fine. <laughs> she wouldn't even get a conversation out of me. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> no cap. Oh, God, she wouldn't. I done said, you know, we all learn when we live and shit. Hell yeah. I'm living and learning. No copy, man. But you, that's probably like the main reason why I think I've been single so long right now. Ain't no problem with that. You feel me? Yeah. Just try to see what's gonna fuck with me or don't. I'm being on YouTube right now, nigga. You feel hey, me? Yeah, 700 man. subs. Shit going up. Just focus on yourself right now. Be careful. They're gonna come. They're gonna come for sure. Well, I might throw this shit and shake shit away, bro. Yeah. Fuck all that bullshit. But anyways. I might just throw that in there. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's down shit, anyways, y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Yeah, that's what right there. Fuck. Let me know if y'all went through the same thing as me. You feel me? But, yeah. I'm going to see y'all later. I think you saw that? I think you don't give a fuck. <laughs>